Hello guys, I am Alex and today I'm going to show you how can you communicate between MicroLogix and Node-RED. So let's check it out. Can you hear me? <laughs> All right, so first thing that you need to do, you need to make sure that you have downloaded like this guy over here so we have the node uh node red contrib pccc so this is the node that we're gonna use today to communicate between micrologics and node red so how can i do that so if you if you don't have installed on node red if you don't you didn't do download yet so you can come here and manage palette or here and manage but in my case I have uh, my my nodes here that I have installed here so this is node red contrib pccc so how can you do that so you need put here uh, pccc and you're gonna see here the first one here is the one that we need install in my case I have installed it so here's he said here it says install it so but uh, in your case if you don't have just click here install and gonna start right away so in my case it is done so i'm gonna just close here so what i'm gonna do here is i'm gonna do that so i'm gonna read a value from microlog so let's choose i'm gonna open it up the plc program here so let's go to the microlog here so yep we are here so i have the microlog here and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read uh, F81. So F81. So in order to do that, what I'm gonna do here right now, I'm gonna be let me go there, F81. And F81 like is the timer here. So let's double click over here. And here uh, we have already done here so what i gonna do over there right now gonna be let me create a new endpoint and what i gonna do here is i gonna uh, the ip address for your plc so in my case gonna be 192.168.10.55 and i go i will not use routing i'm gonna just leave in blank here we don't have the, and the name gonna be like okay um rs logics 500 so or uh, micro logics okay because my plc is a micro logics 1100 so what i'm gonna do here right now i'm gonna do this uh variables so i'm gonna add the variables here and the address is gonna be f8 slash one uh column one so i'm gonna put like timer timer and timer n so i'm gonna add here and what i'm gonna do here right now i'm gonna select a variable timer n that we just created here so we're gonna call like timer and that's it i'm gonna press done and it is here so in order to see if it is communicating or not so i'm gonna deploy this project here and we are be able to see communication so 44 45 so i'm gonna put here um yeah so 50 51 50 53 54 so let's take a look on that 59 60 so basically it's the same okay it's the same that we that so we, we 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 can see here so that that's communicating with node red so it's good um so the the, cl the the class today is just to show you how can i communicate with plc and node red and micro i hope you enjoy and see you next class